Hi everyone, I just wanted to show you how to embed external content into a, a portfolio page. Now I'm actually within my portfolio which is um, the Mahara software um, but it will look a little bit different to what we've been using within our own course. It's a couple of versions ahead of what we're using. Right, so I'm in a blank page and there's nothing on it yet and you'll notice that the uh, tabs run along there external content is one of those tabs so I'm just going to click on it and there are three options first one is RSS and this just allows you to grab content from a website like a newspaper and display it on your page another one is Google Apps uh, which means that you can embed Google Documents into a page now other websites that use Mahara have uh, other external media uh, blocks added to them. For example, Microsoft have SkyDrive. Um, so this might be an option that you could use depending on your institution. Now we're just going to drag the middle block onto our page. So I'll just do that. And you'll notice that um, a dialog box has come up. Now what we are going to do is go and visit one of the websites. Um, now each of these has a different website that you can uh, visit and embed content from it. Uh, there are so many to uh, explore and this is just the beginning of the list. Um, we're all familiar with YouTube, so that's the first one I'm going to go to. It will open a new window. And I'm just going to type in ePortfolio and search. I'll just click on the first one that appears. Now that I've found the video that I want, uh, I can copy the address for that. Now there are two Meet places Sandra. to find She's it. She's a busy academic. Under share, you'll see the address there. I don't need to worry about the embed code um, or I can grab the address from up the top. So I'm just going to copy it, go back to my page and paste it in there. I'll give it a name also. Now I can give it a width depending on how I've set my page up and click save. Now that media is embedded within my page. Now just to make it look a little bit better, I'm just going to change the layout to equal width. And I can go back in and configure that to make it look a little bit better. In fact, I'll go to 500. Right, that's it, embedding external content onto a web page.